but uh, uh, north wind at 14. We had south and southeast wind much of the day yesterday from Poria, uh, Burlington, Melbourne, Council Grove, Osage City, and that kept the temperature up. Now those uh, highs in the 80s are all the way down in Oklahoma, Arkansas, and Texas. So we have mid 40s to mid 50s this time across northeast Kansas and dry so far. But as we uh, zoom out on the Capitol Federal Live Storm Tracker, there are storms and even severe storms this time from Missouri to Oklahoma down into Texas. There is a tornado risk with this, not for us. Uh, also dealing with some hail down to the south as well with these storms. Now, the way this affects us uh, most greatly is that a lot of the moisture uh, coming up from the Gulf of Mexico is really being used up by that line of storms that extends across Missouri into Oklahoma. And if you look at the surface, winds are coming in from the north and northeast here. This drier air, the higher humidity coming in from the Gulf of Mexico is running into this frontal boundary, turning into storms and rain. So we will see rain in our area tonight and tomorrow as well. It just won't be significant rain. A big part of the reason is because uh, the moisture from the Gulf is really locked up uh, deep to the uh, south of us. Look at the temperature of those 82 in Little Rock, 82 in Dallas. Those temperatures were all the way to Emporia, uh, Burlington and Council Grove yesterday, but now this dividing line between the warmer air and the uh, cooler conditions is where we're seeing the showers and storms. On Supercast, again, the heaviest rain stays south. We'll see some scattered rain tonight, light rain, temperatures dipping to the mid 30s. So make sure the kids are ready at the bus stop tomorrow morning for temperatures in the 30s with light rain. It'll be uncomfortable. It won't be snow or ice, but there'll be a, a cold rain falling early in the morning. So we'll go 37 in Topeka. Tomorrow afternoon, a high of 50. There'll be scattered showers, maybe a rumble of thunder. Not more than a tenth of an inch of rain tomorrow as the uh, system to our south is still eating up a lot of that moisture, but high temperatures chasing 50. Here's Supercast showing tomorrow evening as scattered showers and maybe rumble of thunder will persist as the evening hours, and then we're most likely dry on Saturday. Now, an interesting thing to watch tomorrow is this area to the south. There'll be a, a risk of seeing severe storms. Even uh, long track tornadoes are possible in southeast Arkansas, parts of Mississippi and Louisiana. That's not here. It's part of the same system that's eating up a lot of our moisture that would give us a, a more widespread heavy rain here if it wasn't uh, locked up in parts of Arkansas to Missouri and Oklahoma with the heavy precipitation going on now. Dry Saturday for the most part. Saturday, Sunday has a rain chance with high temperatures near 50 degrees and that will stay mild. The last, the end of March is uh, next Friday, so April begins next weekend. April showers. That's right. Bring May flowers. You know.